Good morning. My name's Rex Vaughn, and I want to tell you about riding a 55-gallon drum out in the lake. The best guess I can do is 500 pounds it'll support. Now, how do we get that? One cubic foot of water weighs 62.4 pounds. That's in one cubic foot. Of water. That's how much weight one cubic foot will support to keep it afloat. Now, how did we get there? A 55 gallon drum that is approximately 22 and a half inch diameter by 35 and 3 quarter inches deep will support 514.42 pounds. This is how it's determined. Diameter times the diameter times 35.75 inches deep equals 18,098 cubic inches. Cut the corners off, 0.7854. So you wind up with 14,214 cubic inches. Now to round that up to cubic feet times triple off 58, you have 8.244 cubic feet. Now we've seen that one cubic foot weighs 62.4 times the cubic feet equals 514.4256 pounds. Round that up to 514 0.43 pounds that a barrel will support. Like I said, now that's a big guess. I'll give you time to write these numbers down. Now, just remember, 514.43 pounds. Now, if the water level and the barrel is full of water, we'll keep it down submerged to the top of the water. Now if you divide that by two, it takes 257 pound man to just get it down to half. So fill the drum half full of water, the empty half will be above the water line. You might be able to write it at that point, but I think you'll want to fill it up more than just half full so the buoyancy will let you keep a balance when you're trying